And in Psycho Talk tonight, pizza candidate, pizza man Herman Cain has a new theory about why African Americans tend to vote for Democrats. Many African Americans have been brainwashed into not being open minded, not even considering a conservative point of view. I have received some of that same vitriol simply because I am running for the Republican nomination as a conservative. So it's just brainwashing and people not being open minded, pure and simple. Oh, come on, Herman. It's not very presidential to say a huge group of voters can't think for themselves. Here are a few reasons, serious reasons, why African-Americans might choose Democratic candidates without being brainwashed. Almost 17 percent of African-Americans are unemployed. Democrats are in favor of, of extending unemployment benefits. Republicans say, well, unemployment benefits just make people lazy. Democrats are in favor of affirmative action. Republicans call it reverse discrimination. Republicans are actively working against the best interests of many African Americans, and they're not hiding their agenda a bit. For instance, Florida Governor Rick Scott cut funding to historically black colleges in his state. Mississippi Governor Haley Barber refused to condemn a license plate honoring a KKK leader. Paul LePage, governor of Maine, told the NAACP to, quote, kiss my butt. And don't get me started on the racist ramblings of the head of the party, your mouthpiece, Rush Limbaugh. I think African Americans know exactly why and what they're voting for in it when it comes time to go into the ballot box. And for Herman Cain to say they have been brainwashed into picking the Democratic candidates is brainless psycho talk. Coming up, one of Breitbart's lackeys attempts to ambush me in Ohio. They say I'm lying? We'll set the record straight. And Governor Rick Perry's poll numbers drop after last week's debate, and he's trying to run from his statement that some fellow Republicans are heartless. Well, they are. Stay with us.